Hello all you Pixel people, I am Pixel and welcome to the start of a brand new Let's Play. This is going to be Black Mesa Source, the Steam Edition. Now, a lot of you guys who've been on the channel for a long time will understand that I have already covered this game when it was released as a mod back almost two years ago, I think it was. And I have been so hyped for the Steam release that I thought, YouTube's got 60 FPS video now, so I will redo this Let's Play at 60 FPS with the updated version and see how this goes. So, I for one am very excited for how this goes. This is the first Half-Life game that I ever played back in the day. And then since then I've done the Let's Plays of every other Half-Life game on the channel. And this game is really responsible for really kickstarting my YouTube channel. So I am so grateful for the guys over at Black Mesa Source for actually getting this game to Steam. So I'm not even going to waste any more time. I'm going to go straight into it. I've set up all the settings. We're going to play a new game. And I'm hyped. I'm so hyped. Let's get into this. Oh, yes. So I've actually got a loading screen. I didn't, I don't, I didn't recognize that from the original release, but uh, Black Mesa, onto the train we go. Honestly, straight off the bat, this game looks better than what I remember from playing the mod originally. I think it's mainly because I went off and played uh, Half-Life 2 straight after and it looked fairly similar. Um, Good morning and, welcome to the Black and then the original Half-Life. Hi mate, how you doing? Train is provided for the security and convenience of the Black Mesa Research Facility personnel. The time is... You okay mate? 8.47 a.m. Current topside temperature is 93 degrees with an estimated high of 105. The Black Mesa compound is maintained at a pleasant 68 degrees at all times. Sorry guys, I'm just taking it all in. It's so long since I've played this game. Wow. You know when you actually just forget how good something is until you replay it? I've got a feeling that this is going to be this game all over. The same loading screen I see. A little bit longer than what I remember. This train is inbound from level 3 dormitories to Sector C test labs and control facilities. If your intended destination is a high security area beyond Sector C, you will need to return to the Central Transit Hub in Area 9 and board a high security train. This just looks absolutely if you have gorgeous. Not yet submitted your identity to the retinal clearance system. You must report to Black Mesa personnel for processing before you will be permitted into the high security branch of the transit system. I think partly because I uh, recently played the original Half-Life, I, I recognize these areas. However, I really appreciate the upgrade that we've got this time around. Where the first time I was just like, wow, yeah, it looks really pretty. Due to the high toxicity of material routinely handled in the Black Mesa compound, no smoking eating or drinking are permitted within the Black Mesa transit system. I totally hope that this does really well on Steam. There's actually a multiplayer component there as well right now. Inside the train at all times. Do and not attempt to open the doors until the train has come to a complete halt at the station platform. It only costs 15 pounds, so around 20 dollars. Passengers are to remain seated and await further instruction. If it is necessary to exit the train, disabled personnel should be evacuated first. Please stay away from electrified rails and proceed to an emergency station until assistance arrives.
So far it's looking very similar, except in 60 FPS goodness. And I feel so much more experienced as a commentator now. I really feel I can make this a really good series for you guys. I hope so at least. That is my goal. I'm trying to keep an eye out for G-Man or something, but I have not seen him yet. What was this anyway in the back? It was in the original, I just can't remember what it said. Ah, oh, the team acquires a new grant. <laughs> oh, if only, knew, if only they knew what that grant was going to cost them. I doubt they would have approved it. Yeah, visually so far it looks almost identical. I'm not seeing anything um, dramatically different or specifically new. Which is cool, still. Like, it was amazing the first time round. You don't have to mess with perfection, right? Finals for high security personnel will be announced in a separate secure broadcast transmission. Remember, more lives than yours may depend on your fitness. That doesn't look safe, mate. Where's your protective goggles? Need your protective goggles, health and safety and all that. For friend or relative who would make a valuable addition to the Black Mesa team, immediate openings are available in the areas of materials handling and classified. Security. That's G-Man, right? Please contact Black Mesa personnel for further information. Wait. If you have an associate with a background in the areas of theoretical physics, biotechnology, or other high-tech disciplines. Oh, I've got to remember seeing this the first time and being really impressed. Still looks amazing. ...facility is an equal opportunity employer. Wouldn't it be so cool if, like, they actually added the ability to drive one of these, even if it's just for a small section? Like, pick up boxes to move them? Version 2.0, right? <laughs> If it wasn't for this game, I would have never played the uh, the other Half-Lives. I think I've now played all of them in a Let's Play. I've done a load of mods as well. ...are a requirement of continued employment in the Black Mesa Research Facility. Missing a scheduled urinalysis or radiation checkup is grounds for immediate termination. If you feel you have been exposed to radioactive or other hazardous oh, materials... There you go. Hello. You're there to distract me, aren't you? See you soon, mate. This does not look safe, does it, at all? Talking about um, radiation poisoning, I just go straight over what looks like toxic waste. Hey Barney. I mean, where is Barney? For the security officer to verify your identity. Before exiting the train, be sure to check your area for personal belongings. Thank you, and have a very safe and productive day. Wow, the Lord time. <laughs> Morning. Are you doing you okay? A little bit, yeah. Are you doing anyway? You okay? You know. Barney's been pretty scarce around these parts. I, I saw him on the way in. He, he got caught. Must have finally caught up with. Bit of a drinker, is he? Not surprised. I've always liked that guy, though. What's in Pepin that step, Freeman? You laid enough as it is. I know, I know, I know, but we're going to be a tiny little bit later. To think. Mom wanted me to waste my money sleeping through college courses when now I'm getting paid to sleep out here. <laughs> oh, God, if only you knew what was coming, fella. Come on, say something. 
How am I supposed to catch my beauty sleep when you're staring at me like that? But I love you. Man, this job is boring me to tears. You, you, you can sleep at least, right? Oh, sorry, Doc. I have to stay at my post. Okay. We can talk on my lunch break. Uh, we won't be talking at your lunch break. Sorry, Mr. Freeman. I'm on duty right now. Okay, come and say something silly. There are a lot of suits walking around today. Try to look busy. Oh, a G-Man reference. Sorry, buddy. I got a job to do. Yeah, right. I can't. But maybe later. I'll meet up with you after my shift's over. Okay. Hey, catch me later. You, me, and Calhoun will go out and get that beer he owes you. Hey, Barney Calhoun! Has anybody ever told you you're a cunning linguist? <laughs> oh. Not now. I'll, I'll stop by when I'm doing my rounds. Uh, can we do this later? Uh, hey, catch me later. We'll, we'll talk about that science stuff some more. This is all unique dialogue. Not now. I'll, I'll stop by when I'm doing my rounds. I hey, catch me later. We'll, we'll talk about that science okay. stuff some more. Okay, okay, thank you very much, mate. Well, wow, that was an awful lot of dialogue options. I'm kind of impressed. Anyway, um, what we're going to do is the same as what we did on the first Let's Play. We're going to actually end it here because this next section is very long. Um, and yeah, I don't want to have like a, a an hour long episode at the very start. So we're going to end it here. Uh, don't forget to slap that subscribe button for some more PC gaming goodness. And as always, like the video if you like the video. I'm going to be doing a few episodes a day until we actually complete this. I am hyped. I am excited. I hope that you enjoy the ride, and I will catch you next time. See you later, guys. Bye-bye.